You know, as somebody who's been in recruiting and career coaching for a lot of years, I'm amazed at how many people are obsessed with finding ways to answer those curveball questions or those unexpected questions in interviews. Yes, they are super important, but how many times have I seen somebody completely flub one of the basic questions? Now, one of those questions I'm talking about is, why do you want this job? And I can tell you that if you don't have a good answer for that, you will be dismissed. My name is JT O'Donnell. I'm the founder of Work It Daily, and this is the YouTube channel that helps you turn frustration into career success. Today, I'm going to be talking to you about how to answer that question correctly. But before I do, I just want to remind you, if you want cutting edge career advice on a regular basis, please make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and definitely click the little bell. That way you're going to get instant notifications. Okay, let's talk about how to answer this very basic question in a way that will knock it out of the park. Now, in order to answer this question correctly, you first got to understand why the hiring manager is even asking it. And the reality is there's several reasons for that. One of them is that they want to make sure that you're not just in it for the money, that there's a bigger purpose involved. The second one is that they want to know that you're not going to leave the moment a better job comes along, that you're really dedicated and committed to this job and their company. And lastly, they want to know that you're capable of doing the work and understand its impact, its value to the organization. So these are just a few of the reasons why you've got to come up with an answer that's really compelling. And I'm going to share with you a secret tip that's going to help you nail this answer each and every time. So my tip is for you to share your connection story. Now, what is a connection story? Well, it's the story where you explain how you feel a direct connection to the organization, whether it's the product and service they provide or their reason for existence or the clients that they serve. The reality is you shouldn't be applying and working for a company unless you feel like you're part of their tribe, like you understand them, like you get why the company exists in the first place. That requires an emotional connection. And that's really the key here. These emotional connections that you can share show feeling. And when you do that, you're sending these positive vibes to employers and they just love it. In fact, if you haven't checked out our disruptive cover letter tutorial, I'm going to make sure you check that out as well, because we use the same technique of sharing your connection in the terms of a story that really has a huge impact on cover letters and is getting people all sorts of jobs. So be sure to check that out. But back to this question, when asked, why do you want this job? You want to tell the story that helps them understand, I get you as an employer. I admire you. I respect you. And that's why I want to be here. So let me give you an example. Let's say that you wanted to work for a local bank. Now, you wouldn't just want to say, oh, I'm really into numbers and I'm really into finance and I heard you're a great place to work. That's a really standard answer that a lot of people probably say, and, and it doesn't drive home those points that we were talking about. But now imagine instead you say, you know, I've been banking at this company for 10 years and every time I come in here, I'm greeted by friendly people. They genuinely care about me and I can tell that they are really entrenched in the community. It makes me feel that my money's safe here and in good hands. And that's the kind of organization I want to be a part of. I want to know that when I'm doing my job, I'm helping people in the community feel like their money is in a good place. I want them to feel the way I felt when I've been here. Do you see how it's so different? How you're talking about your connection to the organization, how you truly feel like you understand why you should be doing that work. There's something there that's just magical and it's truly what employers want to hear. Because of course they know that they're paying you to do the job and that you want the money. And of course they know that you want to grow your career. But what they really want to hear is what they're going to get in return. And that's what this connection story is all about. So I'm going to be honest and say that there are some real curveball questions out there, but this really shouldn't be one of them. And I hope that this showed you today that it's very easy to create an incredible response to that question that's going to just knock it out of the park. Now, if you've been having trouble with interviews and interview questions specifically, please check out the resource I've got up here below. It's going to help you answer all those tough behavioral questions that companies are throwing you these days. It's a very popular interviewing technique, and it's one that you need to understand and be able to respond to. So this resource is really going to help you with that. All right, you know I always love to ask this question at the end of videos. Was this helpful? If so, what was the most helpful part? Please tell us in the comments. It really helps us shape the content that we create for you on a weekly basis. Also, questions, comments, anything else, please put them down there below. We love to respond to you, and you know that we do. All right, with that in mind, I can't wait to see you in the next video. And please remember this. If you want to win, you got to work it daily.